Hey everyone, Dee Dee here. Just thought I'd show you a couple of uh, stores that I went to this week. I went to Tuesday Morning and Michael's. And um, from Tuesday Morning, I picked up a few things. I got this, a couple of these um, washi tapes from Cosmo Cricut. They had these. This is called Hello. And then I picked up this one. This one is called Ruler. And these were $2.99. And then I picked up these four um, Versa Magic chalk inks. I've never had these before, so I thought I'd try them. And this one's Pumpkin Spice, Cornucopia, Persimmon, and Sierra Vista. And I stamped them out so you could see them. I just thought these were good for fall. You know, I like these colors, so. That's what colors they are. I didn't have any of those colors, so I thought, uh, I'll try them. They were like, I think, I took the packaging off, but I think they were $2.50, I want to say. And I picked up a couple of these sprays, because um, my Tuesday morning didn't have them. these before, and they are $1.99, so I picked up the, like an orange shade, and then like a maroon shade. And then the last thing I got from there was, I found these um, stamp file cards from... Copper Hopper, and there's 15 in a pack. They were $1.99, and they're made, um, I took one out so you could see it. They're made out of like a plastic, and you, they're really made for you to keep your stamps on to store, you know, and then you put them in this uh, Crapper Hopper container, but that's not really what I bought them for. I bought them for to, so I could label them and put them like a divider between my stamps. Um, I'll show you what I do. Sorry. Um, I put them in these little containers and then I just put these, you know, I just labeled them with my label maker and then that way I know, you know, what, where the stamps are instead of searching for them. So, I mean, that works for me. And then um, the reason why I don't want to put them on those containers or these um, sheets is because I store my stamps in the I like to store them in the packaging and I also like when I stamp I stamp a couple extra images so then I just keep it in the packaging so then I know where they're at when I want to use it so that's what I do but um, for $1.99 for 15 of them um, I just thought that was a good solution for me but maybe down the road I might change but for right now that works and if anybody you know uses these I mean I thought that was a good price and they really do stick it's not like they're gonna go anywhere so and then from uh, Michaels I picked up a few things um, I saw somebody had posted that that Michaels was carrying the Mod Podge melts so I got the beach glass clear and then I got the milk glass white and then I picked up a couple, or uh, three of the, the, what do you call it, the molds. And this one is called Nature. They have four at Michael's, but I didn't really like the other, the fourth one. I just picked up the three that I liked. And so this one has like an owl and the butterflies and the birds. And I think that's like a nest. So I just thought that was cute. And this one is called Ornaments. And I thought this one would be good for like a cameo if you made it and then put a cameo in there. And then this one is called Flowers. And it has all different flowers and leaves. So I'm going to try them, see if you know how they. I, I've seen a couple um, demonstrations um, on YouTube and it looks like a lot of fun and you can paint them or glitter them or whatever you want so it, it would be it's going to be cute to make these embellishments I'm going to try anyway and then um, I also picked up this from Michaels this stamp and I've never I used a coupon and I also used a coupon on all those other ones too because I think Michaels last week had um, if you spent so much you got you know ten dollars or five dollars off or whatever it was so that's what I used and then I used a separate coupon for this and um, I've never seen these inky antics stamps there before so 
when I saw it, I just thought this was so adorable. I know it's Christmas, but I just didn't want to wait. And they only had one, so I thought, eh, I'll go back and they won't have it. So I just picked it up. I thought this was adorable. So I got that. And then a, a few other things that I did get from Michaels were all on clearance. Uh, now, I didn't hit, find any penny deals. They never do at mine, but that's okay. I, I found a few things. Um, these were 50 cents. These um, trims, and I, I have it in pink, uh, blue, and yellow. You know, I thought that was pretty good for 50 cents. These were quarter. These little flowered... Um, crocheted flowers and I got it in pink and a red. That's all I could find. I found these couple of these little organza bags. There's four in here and these are the only two I could find and these were a quarter. And that's, you know, good for racks and that's, so that's what I thought that would be good for. And then um, I got these stamps. These are all 50 cents. They were like in their clearance thing. So I got this one, the fish, this one, little whale, the boat, the owl, and then I got my initial. And then um, I found these. These were a dollar. These little chalkboard signs. This one, and then I found the heart ones. And then these little butterflies, these were a dollar too, but I thought these were really cute. These were the multicolored ones, and then I found the black and white ones. And then I found these um, uh, Recollections flowers. These were a dollar fifty. And that's what I picked up at Michael's. And then from Jamie's shop, who is not too shabby here on Zibit, on Zibit. Um, I don't have her card in, fr in front of me, so I can't show it to you, but you, I'm sure you all know who she is. But I picked up my first um, saturated canary stamp from her. Um, I got this one, Windy Day. That's how big she is. Um, Honey. And Elfie. So that's what I picked up this week. So we'll talk to you later, everybody. Take care. Bye.